For the patient who needs a corneal transplant, uh, one of the things I'll often say to my patients is it takes a patient patient and a patient doctor a little bit because we do a lot of really remarkable, uh, almost miraculous things in ophthalmology with LASIK and cataract surgery where the next day everything is spectacular and the patients are you know, smiling ear to ear on the first day. Corneal transplants aren't like that. They do require some healing. It's basically a transplant of a human tissue. It's the most common transplant uh, done uh, actually in the world, more common than kidneys or hearts or livers or lungs or anything else. But there is a healing period because that donor cornea that comes from an eye bank then has to heal into your body. Uh, we have to place it into place and allow that healing to take place. With uh, the partial thickness transplants like DSEC or DMEC, uh, the recovery is much faster for patients. Normally they have lifting restrictions only for a couple of weeks. Uh, they are on uh, drops to help prevent rejection. Some of those drops are forever and ever. And uh, the, the patient's vision typically recovers within a few weeks with the partial thickness transplants, even though full recovery could take several months. A full thickness cornea transplant, though, is a much longer recovery, and it's probably about a year to year and a half of recovery process because there's uh, uh, lots of little sutures in the cornea that must slowly be removed over the first year or so. Um, this is the this is the optical recovery that we're working on to try to normalize the shape and decrease warpage of the cornea from the uh, the sutures that are placed. During this time, the patient can do normal activities. It's really just about the first month or so that we try to have them limit any heavy physical activity. Uh, but after that, they can do normal activities, but it's just uh, the vision recovery until we get the final glasses or contact lens prescription can be about a year or so down the road. The thing I would tell a family member or my patients is that this isn't an instantaneous everything is better uh, process. The outcomes are excellent. Uh, but there is a, a healing period that has to occur and there'll be several visits you know over that year rather than one or two visits and everything is fine like it is with some types of surgery we do in this case you'll probably get to know your doctor really well so make sure you like your doctor because you're going to see that doctor probably you know six eight times in the first year and maybe a couple times a year thereafter. Mm -hmm.